Field hockey has started off hot this season. Coming into this week, their record sat at 4-1, with their only loss being handed to them by the top-ranked team in the state, Walpole. However, the Rockets have begun to put people on notice. With a high-powered attack, they've accumulated 16 goals in their first five games. On Tuesday, September 26, they looked to keep their hot streak going when they hosted Natick, another strong team in the Bay State. In what was anticipated to be an even match, one team was definitely outmatched. So, let's find out who. Three minutes in, Needham with a corner. Sarah Dorian passes to Bridget Roque, gets it right back, and somehow gets the goal from that angle. Rockets lead 1-0 early. Heading now to the second half, ball pushed to Lily Schmall. She crosses it in front. Jillian Flukiger right there for the goal and scores. Perfect execution puts Needham up 2-0. 30 seconds now left in the third. Natick trying to get on board. They force it inside, but Caitlin McNeil right here makes her first save of the game. As we take things into the fourth quarter, Needham with a corner, pass up top. Lily Schmal's in the middle, but the goalie's somehow able to get her glove on that to deflect it away. Nine and a half to go. Red Hawks get it in Rockets territory. Initially saved here by McNeil, but the ball's still alive, and Natick capitalizes, cuts the lead to one. But not for too long, another corner for Needham. Out to Roach, who passes to Flukiger, inside to Olivia Alper, and she's able to score Rockets back up by two goals. And they wouldn't rest there. Another corner opportunity out to Roach. Ball being slapped around and eventually tipped in right here by Schmalz. Gets that insurance goal, and that wraps it up. Needham takes the win over Natick 4-1 with four different goal scorers on the day. On Wednesday, they would take down Medfield to improve to 6-1 on the season. They'll look to continue their winning ways when they travel to Bishop Fian on Friday, September 29th at 6 p.m. After a tough, non-characteristic loss to Brookline, girls volleyball has bounced back in a big way with back-to-back -back sweeps over Braintree and fellow Division I powerhouse Barnstable. On Wednesday, September 27th, Needham would face off against a tough Walpole team who was undefeated coming into the Agen. However, it was clear from the first serve who would land on top. So let's head to the highlights. Needham looking to continue their dominance over Walpole, winning the last 10 matchups between the two. As we head in the action early in the first, Kayla Smith passes up to Lizzie Tan, back sets for Sadie Stance, and she kills it cross court. Needham in control starting out. Walpole goes to the outside and it's blocked by Claire Smith. Rock is dominating up 7-0 to start and Lizzie Tam, a big part of that, gets the ace right here. She would have three of those early in the first. Needham up by 12. This time it's set for Katie Mercer right here in the middle. Picks the perfect spot for the point. Needham would take the first set 25 to 14. As we head to the second, Walpole starts out hot up by four, but Izzy Streeper bump sets to Samantha Tam, smacks it all the way to the back corner. Rockets down by three. Tam sets the middle for Madison Demir Fernandez, and she gets the kill. She would make a difference in this set. 14 12 Needham Fernandez kills it right here, but the T Wolves all over it. Although another loose ball over the net, and Fernandez takes care of it the second time. I told you she's making a difference. 22 20 Needham stands with the dig to Tam, gets it right back to her. And a big kill right here by the sophomore puts Needham up by three. The very next point, Sam Tam serving, and she's able to drop it down for the ace. That sets up set point of the second. Alex Sakura saves it to Lizzie over to Stans, who just pushes it in the perfect area. Rockets rally off five straight points and take the second 25 to 20, leading two sets to none. On to the third, Rockets leading early 5-0. One-handed dig here by Streeper. Lizzie bumps it to her sister from the 10-foot, and Sam gets the kill. Needham up by 11. Streeper here with the dig to Tam. Sets the outside for Sakura, and she smacks it through the hands of the blockers. Needham dominating the third game point. Rachel Doherty serving. She's able to get the ace and closes it out. Needham wins the third 25-13 and sweeps Walpole to move to 6-1 on the season. An all-around team effort today from the girls that look to continue things rolling when they host Natick on Tuesday, October 3rd at 4 p.m.